First of all, I'd like to thank you for your business and welcome to the Sunset Auto family. Thanks for taking the time to come to our Right From The Start clinic. I think we're going to give you some information that you're really going to enjoy. And I know it's going to take a few minutes out of your life, but it's going to be well worth it. Thank you. All right. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us for Right From The Start. My name is Rob. I'm the service manager at our Sunset Ford location, and I'm joined this evening by Tim, who's the service director for the Sunset Automotive family. Hi. First thing I want to talk about is we are live tonight, so if, as you guys go through this presentation, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to put them in the chat section. Um, we have a team of people standing by who are going to answer these questions as promptly as possible, and we're even going to take some over the air and get some more into specifics about them. They'll figure out we're live. They'll figure out. Yeah, they'll, they'll, they'll know. We're live. <laughs> um, and we also have uh, an email set up. Uh, it's uh, we care at sunset autofamily.com. We're going to be manning that one as well. Uh, we may ask to respond to you or some more technical questions there, um, just because it's a little better form. Once this ends, uh, I think the comment section will stay open for a little while, but it might close. So, um, all right, I'm super excited. We're going to get started. We have a lot of really good information to cover tonight. Um, some of the topics we're going to cover are old changes for life program. Uh, we're also going to talk about our warranty protection for life. And then we're going to end with uh, sunset in the community and some of the things we do to give back every single day. Yeah. Lots um, to cover. And then, yeah, lots to cover. And if you stay to the end, there's going to be a giveaway for everybody who stayed. So make sure you stay in with us uh, until the end. Uh, we're going to start with a video that shows you how our right from the clin uh, right from the start clinics used to happen. Um, so go ahead and watch that video with us. Take a trip down memory lane. All right. Do you see all those people? A lot of people, a lot of pancakes, a lot of, pancakes. A lot of breakfast. Yep. No masks. No masks. <laughs> yeah, just, we haven't had that many people together in the shop in years. Yeah. Uh, it was so nice this week to not have our masks on when we were back to work. It, it was nice. Good to see everybody's faces. So as you guys see, that's how we used to do this program. Um, the contents of what we're trying to achieve has really stayed the same, and that's give you guys a platform of just kind of breaking the ice on what these programs entail, what your service experience is going to be like with us, but also get you guys together and meet you know, the family, meet the Sunset Automotive employees, us as managers. Um, the guy in the suit doing all the talking up front was Mike. You're going to hear from him a little later in the presentation. Yeah. He had to take a back seat to us. Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, you know, it's it's great to have you guys here. Um, we didn't have to make a change to now this platform, but we're really happy with how it's turned out. And, and we're really appreciative of all you guys joining us here. Yeah, we're here to answer questions. So Absolutely. So fire, Absolutely. Fire please, away. yeah, please, if you guys have questions, that's what we're here for. So um, the first topic, like we talked about, is going to be our oil changes for life. we got a short video we're going to show you, and then we're going to get into some of the specifics. Yeah. So my car's oil light comes on the other day. Then I look at that little reminder sticker and, uh-oh, 5,000 miles overdue for an oil change. <gasps> Oops. Then, wow, Jiffy Monkey, or whatever it's called, has a special for just like 44 bucks. What a deal. So I pull in and... <laughs> what? That $44 deal just turned into a $135 ticket. It needed synthetic oil, 50 bucks more, two additional quarts, another 20 bucks, oil filter and disposal fee, plus sales tax, and the next thing you know, old Jed's a millionaire. Then I remember Sunset's oil changes for life. Now I get five oil changes a year. That's almost 700 bananas a year at Jiffy Monkey. But drive a Sunset vehicle for like 10 years, and that's almost $7,000 in savings. Drive a diesel truck, and you're saving closer to 10 grand instead of going to Jiffy Monkey. That's if they have the right oil filter in stock. Okay. So when you're car shopping, remember this. No one can sell you a vehicle for less than Sunset. No one. And you'll save thousands on oil changes with Sunset Auto Family's oil changes for life. You just get more at Sunset, and people do like that. All right. So, uh, so many bananas so many you're bananas. saving. I know. I love those videos. Yeah. It is impressive how much money you save. Though. Absolutely. You've got a truck. Yeah, You've got I've a got a diesel truck. I've got a newer diesel truck, and I can tell you, I, I don't drive it as much as some other people do. I still get three oil changes a year, and those oil changes are starting at $150. Yeah. You know, with the cost of petroleum and gas and everything else, yeah. I need every penny I can save to put that into my tank. Yeah, We've sure. got some customers that are getting those five oil changes a year, Mark. That's that's huge money. That's seven hundred and fifty dollars at least. Thousands of dollars. I'll yeah, say. absolutely. And we we give away. We do a lot of free oil changes. A lot of complimentary oil changes. We did thirty thousand. Thirty thousand free oil changes last year. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah that a, is crazy. And again, every single one of those is done free of charge. Whenever you guys need them done, whenever you're scheduled them in. Um, just like with every other program, there are some specifics from where do I get my vehicle serviced? When do I service it? Yeah. How do I service it? Who do I service it with? Um, and Tim's going to break down a lot of those questions for us now and, and get some answers. Yeah. Well, there's a lot to cover, but obviously uh, it's one of the great reasons you got your vehicle from Sunset is lifetime oil changes. 
Um, obviously, we went over the typical savings, but it is it is a huge savings for our customers. Who receives the uh, lifetime oil change program? It's the original owner of any sh any new Chevrolet, new Ford, Kia, or Mitsubishi purchased at a Sunset location, and uh, or possibly a select pre-owned vehicle. We have um, one or possibly a two-year-old model, same make and models uh, that that could qualify. So those are uh, the limit limitations. Uh, what you're going to receive when you redeem your oil change, you're going to have a, a complimentary lube oil filter change. We're going to use high quality factory filters and obviously the appropriate synthetic oil now, which is what all the vehicles are taking. Mm -hmm. We top off your underhood fluids, uh, set your tire pressures, and we're going to do a multi-point uh, vehicle inspection. Give it a quick visual yep. check. Awesome. Where do you redeem it? You're going to redeem the uh, oil change at the dealership where you got your vehicle from that's yep. that's the big thing um there it is possible to transfer but it's only a brand to a brand transfer so if you bought yep. a ford at the chevy store you could transfer it to ford but fords would go to ford chevy's yep. it to chevy and kia's would go to kia it's, and that's that's really important because again it's the continuity of service it we is. have our factory trained technicians and our technicians spend hundreds of hours every single year keeping up those factory certifications yeah um, and that's and we yeah. we would encourage you to take Take your, especially your newer model vehicles Absolutely. to so the training group of techs to service it. Yep. And we've got the right oil. We've got the mm -hmm. right filters. We've got everything there at the facility that you're going to need. Absolutely. People ask all the time, can I transfer to an outside dealership? <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, that's a good one. we have not had a successful customer yeah. do that yet. I yep. would like to hear of one, but there are no dealerships out there that will honor the, su the Sunset <laughs> Oil Change Program. Yep. So obviously you're, you're going to need to redeem it at at the Sunset location where you got your vehicle. Uh, when your vehicles, when's your vehicle due for service? It's typically every 7,500 miles, but it does vary from model to model. We have some vehicles out there with uh, the Mitsubishi's at 3,000 miles, and we have some trucks at, at uh, some diesel the trucks diesel. at every yep. 10,000 miles. So we're going to put a reminder sticker in your window after the service, uh, clean window cleaning up in the upper corner of your windshield. That's going to be a reminder for 5,000 miles. Yep. Right Many of our cars have oil change reminders built into the computers on the dash that's going to remind you to when to have it serviced. You can follow the oil life monitor. But if you just aren't sure, use that 5,000 miles as a guide. We are uh, going to really highly recommend that you get to know your owner's manual Absolutely. and know when the service are due for your vehicle because that's, that's the important thing. Uh, you got a collector Mustang, collector Corvette, something that you're not driving much, only in the summer, a few times, and you're not driving, putting the miles on. Mm -hmm. It is very important that you service the vehicle once per year. Absolutely. And that's directly from the manufacturers. Yeah, so. and if you're one of those guys who doesn't like to drive their car in the rain, which is tough up here, we have a couple of them. Yeah. I, you reach out to us at the service departments, and we will schedule you in and get you in as a convenient time where you're comfortable driving your car. Yeah, one of the 10 sunny days a year. Yeah, exactly. exactly. Yeah. We'll make it work. <laughs> So then uh, you're probably wondering, how do you schedule service? Well, obviously two ways. You can uh, get right online to our websites mm -hmm. and uh, click on the uh, uh, service tab, click on the appointment tab. You will, uh, we will offer you an appointment that's tied into our computers. So the uh, computer's integrated. So we're gonna offer you any appointment that's available mm -hmm. and you can choose that spot and then it becomes yours. So it's simple that way. Uh, another very convenient way is just to call in. And I think it's even a more thorough version because we have some well-trained service schedulers who you're going to talk to on the phone. They're going to make sure your information is correct. They're going to get you a time and date that's convenient for you. And then they're also going to take the time to make sure that your car doesn't have any recalls. If it has recalls, they can prepare you for for that service. And then also uh, see if you're due for any, any of the major services, which now are usually 45 or 90,000. But Kias are, are can be different 30, 60, or 90. So yep. there are some services that you might be due for that we're going to try to uh, remind you Recalls. of. Recalls, yep. People ask all the time, well, it's so hard to get in for oil changes. We're booked up. Well, yeah, 30,000 free oil changes a year. We are booked up. We get booked, yep. We uh, have built a system that accommodates customers who just if they just life gets in the way absolutely you you forget you it creeps up on you something happens in life the car takes the back seat and oh my gosh i'm due for an oil change and i'm going to be late we offer an emergency oil change appointment at each of our locations every day and that emergency spot is is 
there to accommodate uh, when those things happen. Yep. The only thing we ask it's is that we'll get it done for you. We just ask you to drop it off for the day yep. because we don't know when we're going to get to it. We're going to get to it when somebody doesn't show. We're yep. going to get to it when we have uh, you know a, a break between vehicles. Somebody's late, so we're gonna we're gonna work it in. We're gonna get it done that day. That's our commitment, but we aren't sure when. Absolutely. Um, so but that is that is there for because life life isn't always. Easy. You know, easy yeah. to book appointments. It's always neat sometimes. And things happen. Yep. So we have, actually, we have multiple appointment spots like that at yeah. each store. Yeah, and it's important to remember, too, when scheduling your appointment, you know, we, we treat cars and, and customers just the same way sometimes emergency rooms do. We're triaging people as they come in through the door. So if you have an emergency, sometimes you know the emergency room wait times are a little longer, but you're there because you know you're going to get looked at as soon as somebody's available. It's no different with your mechanical appointments or your oil changes. If you can bear with us on the time frame, we're going to get you guys looked at. We're going to get your cars going back down the road. We are. And then when you arrive, what do you do? Okay, well, Chevy and Ford, you can see in the video there. You're going to pull right into the service bays. There's uh, cover, garage doors you're going to pull the vehicle into, and you're going to be greeted by a, a, one of our service porters or obviously our uh, one of the service advisors is going to yep. help to write up your repair order and get you in line and get you going. Uh, Kia store, you're going to pull underneath that carport area. It's more of a covered entryway, and, and Steve, a uh, very friendly mm -hmm. greeter, will greet you right there in a the service drive and get you going. So those are kind of the details about the service visits, and I um, just want to reach out to Mike. Mike, you're in the booth. Wondering, hey, guys, uh, how you doing? You, you know, it's yet. one thing to take a back seat to you guys. There's another one for you to lock me in this little tiny booth. <laughs> I, we, well, do, yeah. it, we do have a great question from Dan. In fact, I want to, I want to thank uh, Frank for asking this question. Was I answered by our team downstairs? And I just want to say howdy, Frank, just so you know we are live. Uh, but Dan asked, are the, are the every 5,000-mile service requirements uh, for the warranty to remain intact? Uh, uh, in other words, they're asking about the strictness of the miles and the varying of the miles. Can you go over that, yeah. Tim or Rob? Yeah, the, yeah, we were going to cover that when we get to the Warranty for Life yeah. program, but it, we do want to yeah. definitely answer that question clearly. The warranty is going to be uh, uh, kept valid by following the, man, the owner's manual, man, the maintenance guideline, the maintenance schedule in the owner's manual yeah. for your vehicle. It's important that you know it. So uh, in most cases, now in today's world, it's 7,500 miles, but not every car is the same. There are some differences. So you want to make sure you follow the maintenance guideline. It's once a year or so many miles. Our 5,000-mile reminder in 98% in of the vehicles that, that we have uh, on the road, mm -hmm. that 5,000 miles is going to be under the requirement yeah. of the manufacturer and that reminders there to make sure you get in in time and and don't and don't have any issues with, with yeah and with again talking about how we how we're scheduled out for oil changes normally we're scheduled out anywhere from seven to ten days um not not too far but it's one of those things that when you get to five thousand miles you know i like to use my trip b i reset my trip a with my gas tanks and i reset my trip b with my oil changes and I, or yeah and i check it not and everybody's is not everybody no, okay, here you. we go no but <laughs> honestly call and schedule it's free you know what I mean? Call yeah. and schedule it. You don't have to worry about fitting it in. There's no budgetary issues. You, all the only got to fit in is an hour with one of us on our service drives, which we try and make pretty painless. But no, it's 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 something that we plan for. We like you guys to plan for. We want to make it as as easy and as seamless as possible. And we really don't want to catch you off guard either. So yeah. we actually have uh, our call center. The girls call out if you yep. if we haven't seen you for six months, we're we're gonna call you and say, hey, how you doing? Are you are you is your car ready for service? Yeah. Because we want to be proactive, a lot like maybe a dentist office. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> trying to get a hold of everybody. Yeah, awesome. A lot of people to take care of. Yes, a lot of people. Anything else, Mike? Yeah, uh, Dan, I believe it's the same Dan, unless we have a number of Dans uh, uh, watching tonight, wants to know about the uh, the average service cost on average. Uh, so from a smaller passenger car to a diesel truck, what would, what would the uh, the regular cost span be on uh, on that oil change service? So oil vehicles. changes, yeah, bare bones, basic oil changes, seventy nine ninety five. Um, and and the then, reason the reason seventy nine ninety five is we we all the stores have gone to full synthetic. Yeah, yeah, full yeah. synthetic, and that was yeah, another no, question that yeah, people no were uh, people were wondering if uh, if the upgraded uh, uh, synthetic oil was included, and of course it is. It is, yeah, yeah it is. because it's required these days, and that's what we're actually yeah. keeping in inventory. So yeah. every so Dan, to answer your question. Uh, uh, have your oil changed every 5,000 miles, you're safe. Your uh, your vehicle will probably tell you when it's due for an oil change because a little light yeah. will go on and say, get this in the shop. 
Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. And again, you know, all the way up to the Corvettes, I think our, our most expensive oil change is one of the new Corvettes and it's gotta be 200, 200 bucks, $220, yeah. something like that. Right. It's a lot. Um, yeah. And it's, you know, every, every vehicle has that monitoring system. Most of them nowadays have that monitoring system and that monitoring system is a, it's a computer. A lot of things affect it. Time, simply the days ticking off will affect it. If you get in your vehicle and you start it when it's 99% or hundred percent right after we change it, you get it home and then you don't get in your car for three months and you go to start it. That may go all the way down to 65 or 70% because every single day it can tick down, um, whether you're driving the car or not. So again, you know, once a year we talk about it, once a year minimum or every 5,000 miles, we want you to just get, give us a call. We're going to be a week or two, you know, probably a week, week and a half out, and then we'll get you guys in scheduled for those oil change visits. Yeah. yeah. Great questions, Dan. Great questions. Thank you. Yeah. Awesome. All right. Next thing we're going to talk about is my favorite topic, which is our warranty protection for life. From a service manager standpoint, this is a great topic for us because it makes the conversations we have later on down the road um, throughout your guys' care, makes them a lot easier. So we have another short video, guys. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, so you've seen those commercials for those so-called extended warranty coverage shields that you have to pay for, and then if you don't read the small print, you find out it doesn't cover exactly what you thought it did, and now those repairs are sucking money out of your bucket like hungry vampire bats at dinner time. Hashtag. <laughs> that coverage shield might not be exactly what it claims to be, no matter what an actor slash rapper slash turn celebrity front man might say. Maybe you drive something with about 50,000 miles in good condition with an expiring factory warranty and you find out one of those warranty ice-cold shields cost around $125 a month on top of your car payment. Sorry for the screaming, but I hate pets. That's an extra $1,500 a year. Over 10 years, that could be as much as fifteen grand, just for the extended warranty. <laughs> if they'll actually cover you. So save your money because the Sunset Auto Family's Warranty Protection for Life is included with every qualifying new or used vehicle, and it costs you nothing, not a penny. It's a Sunset exclusive. You just get more at Sunset, and people do like that. Yeah. All right, awesome. I love those videos. I do too. You know, bats and bananas and pancakes and yeah, yeah no, no, yeah. awesome. All right, so like we talked about, our warranty protection uh, program is such a huge staple with Sunset. I mean, that that warranty is paid out. How how much money do you think? Well, it's a huge benefit to our customers. We we know that there have been over four million dollars of paid claims. <laughs> that's so awesome. So that's four million dollars our customers yeah. have saved. Yeah, and that's huge, guys. And that again, that's not. There's no gimmicks to this. That's not just at Sunset. That's anywhere in the continental U.S., any ASC shop. doesn't have to be a dealership. You're out on a road trip. You move to Texas or anywhere. You take this warranty with you. It's it, it's covering all internal lubricated components of the car right. for the life you own the vehicle. It's such a good program. And again, like we talked about with the maintenance records, there are some specifics about it and some tricks that we're going to give you guys um, to help make sure that you guys stay covered. So, Tim, what are some of the more details? Well, just the important thing is, like we said earlier, follow the manufacturer's maintenance schedule in your owner's manual and get to know it. Just make sure you stick to it. It's important that the oil changes are done on time, the transmission fluids changed on time, the coolant, the spark plugs, all those things are important to make sure the engine is maintained so that if, the, if there's ever a problem in the area, we're going yeah. gonna to take care of it. And, the, and there's proof that you'd maintained it the way it was supposed to be maintained. That's the, that's the biggest thing. The other is don't modify the vehicle. You can't put a lift mm -hmm. kit on it. Uh, you can't yeah. put programmers and no chips deletes, and no, guys. no deletes on the diesels. Mm -hmm. you, you, there are a few little things you can do. You do an air filter mod. Mm -hmm. You can put on a cat back exhaust system. Yep. Uh, but, kit. but no headers, you yep. know, you can do, you can do a level a kit, level. but yep. no lift kit. Um, so there's there's some stipulations. You don't want to modify the vehicle too much, or or that will that will actually void the warranty. So, yep. um, you know that's that's important to know. But the main thing is the maintenance and the maintenance record. So you would go to Michigan, yep. took a trip with the family, and you're in Michigan somewhere. And you need to get the oil change. It's time. You want to make sure you take it to an ASE shop. You get a receipt that shows the date, the mileage, the VIN number, and the services that were performed, and you hang on to that. Yep. Because if you ever have an issue, we can provide all the receipts in our location. Absolutely. But we just can't help. You're going to have to help present the ones that you had done elsewhere. Yeah, and if you still have this pamphlet you, everybody got when you purchased your car, there's a really cool spot here that gives you uh, gives you an opportunity to to, to Put down where you got it from. If you give us, if we can have the name, phone number, and the address of the place you had the services done, we will call and collect your maintenance records for you. We do run into some issues from time to time. You know, places do go out of business. Um, so if yeah. you can 
keep those invoices. Keep the receipts, yeah, keep, staple it to this book. Do do everything you can. Just do everything you can to make sure you're covered because we're going to go to bat for you and we're going to help. And that also goes with, too, as you maintain your vehicle and as you get the warranty work done in other places, if you do move, they, they are going to have to reach out to us or you're going to have to reach out to us to collect those. We deal with these warranty companies every single day. We sell their products and we stand behind them. So we know how to work with them. We know the ins and the outs of it. So don't be a, don't hesitate. Don't be afraid to call us if you have questions or you're just curious how this ball is going to bounce as it goes down that repair thing. You know, sometimes people just, you don't know. and But we deal with it every single day. And there can be some confusion too sometimes. Um, mm-hmm. You know, that you there might be a warranty that you purchased. Oh, yeah. And that, yep. That's going to be a warranty that covers everything else on the vehicle. It's yeah, called a wrap. So it's going to cover the power window motor that went out or anything that, that else that, that could be an issue. This powertrain warranty is strictly the engine, transmission, the drivetrain. Yeah. And it's the internally lubricated parts. So the people say, well, what about my other warranty that I bought? That yeah. warranty that yeah. you purchased isn't tied to the maintenance records. Right. It's it's covering things that don't have maintenance. Right. Window motors. Wiring switches. problems or computers, yeah. things in cars that, yeah. that, you know, you run into. And it's great. It's yeah. a great warranty to have, I'll tell you. Cause, 100%. Hey, Stuff's getting expensive. I've seen $900 power window motors. Yeah, absolutely. It's, it's amazing. Yeah, and the warranty, the warranty protection for life is going to keep you going down the road. That certified wrap or any kind of warranty you purchase on top of that is just going to keep those convenience things up. It's going to keep the rest of the car going as well. So yeah. there's definitely is value in that. Um, if you purchase one of those for sure. With COVID, we were all, you know, there's a lot of deferred maintenance. So we got to oh, yeah. make sure you're up on your maintenance, make sure you're servicing it according to the owner's manual. Mm-hmm. And so get, like I say, get familiar with it. If you have questions, we have plenty of us that can answer our managers, service Absolutely. advisors. We all have those available to us. We can go over them with you and help you understand them. Absolutely. Yeah, and if you guys are ever in the dealerships, even for oil change or something, and you want to, you have questions for us, you can talk to the service advisors. Or Tim and I are usually in our office here. More than welcome to poke your head in and meet us, and we'll come out and go over some specifics, answer any questions, give you a little shop tour. Uh, it's a great opportunity for us to, to come out and meet you guys. So we look forward to doing that for yeah. sure. Mike? What you got in your little tiny booth going there? Yeah, we do. Yeah, Michael Newman, thanks for the question, Michael. Uh, uh, This is more of a uh, a finance question, finance and insurance question, but uh, asks, does the wrap warranty cover wheel bearings and those kinds of things? Uh, That would be yes. Yes. Yeah, Yeah. your wrap warranty will have a description of everything that is excluded. Yeah, an exclusionary list. So the exclusionary list is exclusion items. And uh, if you look in your... Uh, at the writing there, it's going to have a list of things that aren't covered. Most of the items that are not covered tend to be trim pieces, mm-hmm. weather stripping, water leaks. There's things that aren't covered, but uh, things like wheel bearings, water pumps, things like that are covered in your, in yeah, your wrap. I th- and I our think it's advisors... Oh, sorry, go ahead, Mike. Oh, I think it's important for people to know that uh, we didn't provide this warranty protection for life for a decade to to uh, to deny claims. That we want right. everybody oh, yeah. to get the claims, yeah. and that uh, and that uh, regardless of what some of the competitors might say, uh, it, the only thing that really is required is just to maintain the manufacturer's minimum requirements. Isn't that right, guys? Hundred yeah. percent. Yeah, and seems we, pretty reasonable. We're, yeah. It's big to us that you know it because you know we're helping these claims get processed yeah and because of covid we've had a lot of a lot of customers have deferred maintenance and and there's been an issue so we just want to make sure everybody's on board and understands and that's yeah. our communication here is is helping our customers we used to do this in a person to person meeting in a big morning breakfast yeah, on a sure. saturday morning and, and everybody had to come down but you know we're this is the opportunity we're trying to convey it and and record it and let you listen to it and watch it and ask questions yeah. it's important we're there's, like I said, there's $4 million worth of paid engine and transmission claims yeah. over, you know, yeah. the last six years. It's amazing. Yeah. And I, uh, I can promise you guys, as a service manager, I would much rather get to make the phone call. You're covered. Yeah. We, awesome. You know, your $20,000 diesel engine, your, your $7,000 10-speed automatic transmission and some of the new Suburbans and uh, Expeditions. Like, we want it to be covered, I promise you, because nobody nobody wants to have to make that phone call. Well, the best case scenario is you never even need it. That's true. Which we have yep. plenty of customers never, yep. ever need it. So, yeah, absolutely. You know, so, yeah, we, it's there for peace of mind. We want to be transparent. We want to be here to help. That's you know, that's the whole premise of this. That's why we're here. So. Anything else, Mike? One, one other point uh, that uh, I think uh, we probably should make is that uh, speaking of misnomers and, and misinformation that spread, um, 
is the service required to be done at a Sunset dealership? Good question. No, it is not. No. Nope. Just you to... can you can definitely take your vehicle to again any ASC shop. The only thing that we ask on your behalf again is keep those maintenance records. Yeah, you 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 do need to take it to an ASC certified shop, and you do need to have so, a receipt that shows the date, the mileage, the mm -hmm. VIN number, and the services performed. And here's what's really important. What I'd recommend is know exactly what you need before you go in there. Because we have had issues where other shops, not a factory shop, is unaware of exactly the, the maintenance that's required. And we do a flush instead of a filter change oh, um, yeah, and, that... th and things like that. It happens. And again, that's why we talk about bringing your vehicle back to that manufacturer. All these things that we're talking about are to make sure that you guys stay covered. You have the peace of mind to go down the road. Yeah. So, and again, if you if you wanted to have your maintenance done somewhere else, call in. We'd be happy to walk you through the required maintenance per your owner's manual um, to, again, set you up for success even to go service at another place. That's fine. That happens with and customers. And the unlikely event area. of a required repair, an emergency repair, if you're within 50 miles or so, we'd sure like to see the vehicle ourselves, but it's not a requirement. In fact, uh, other dealers that might be requiring that are in violation of the Magnus and Moss Act, uh, which uh, 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 prohibits the requirement to bring a vehicle back to the dealership for warranty work. But you want us to keep the warranty records and the service records, the maintenance records, everything's real tidy. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, the main, yep. the if there is ever a breakdown inside 50 miles, we tow it back to one of our locations. Yep. Thank you, guys. Great absolutely. questions, everybody. Awesome. All right. Well, like any visit anywhere you go nowadays, you get surveys, right? You're oh, gonna God, get. We survey we, people to death. We serve. Yes, we do. <laughs> we do send out a lot of surveys. But there's real quick. I just want to go over the reasons why they're important. So you're going to get a survey from us, from each manufacturer and dealership, from each Sunset location when we close your repair order. Those come directly to us as the service managers. It gives us a snapshot of your experience and any quick feedback you may have. A couple of days after that, if you qualify, you're going to get a manufacturer-specific survey. Now, if, if for whatever reason we, you can't give us a perfect survey, please call one of us um, or any of the general managers at locations, even a service advisor. Call somebody and let them know ahead of time because I want to make sure that you're satisfied with your visit. And I want to work to prove that to you each and every day. And I know Tim and Justin at the Kia store, we, we all want the same thing. Yeah, we have great teams. You yeah. know, you got yourself and David at Ford. You got Justin and Roman at Kia, myself and Tyler at Chevy. We Our goal is to make sure you're satisfied. So if you can't give us a true perfect score, mm -hmm. give us a call. Absolutely. We, you know, things happen. Things mm -hmm. fall through the cracks. We make mistakes. Whatever yeah. it is, we're here to make it right. Yeah. Because those surveys are super important, the ones that come from the manufacturer, and I'm sure you've heard it plenty of times, but the reason is when when we have a high standing with great scores with the manufacturer, in their eyes, we're doing a good job with our customers. So when something unusual happens to your car and it's outside of factory warranty and there's no coverage anywhere, we can go to bat and, and we're empowered to reach out and try to get some assistance and some help on the cost of that repair. So that doesn't happen to dealers that have poor CSI. No. We ha Our high standing lets us do that yeah. more often than not for our customers. So, Absolutely. So it's a win-win for everybody. Um, you know, it's so that's why we, we ask, you know, if you can give us a perfect score, do it. If you can't, please call us because yep. we, we'd like We'd like to earn a chance to, to help you do that. Yeah, and, and please don't don't hesitate to give us the direct feedback. You know, sometimes people go take to social media, Yelp, all these other places. We don't have direct ties back to you who you are when you do that. You know, I, the an anonymity might be a thing, but I want to know if you had an issue, I want to fix it. I'm taking 100% ownership of that. This is not falling you as a customer. I don't care if you're upset or your spouse is upset or your kids are upset. I, it doesn't matter. Please call me directly, send me an email, reach out to the store, whatever you got to do. Because again, if you take to other platforms, it just muddies the water and we can't, we, sometimes we can't even give you the feedback or even call you because we don't even know who you are. Or fix the problem. Or in fix the in problem, most yeah. cases, most cases they're training opportunities and Absolutely. or they're just yeah. communication breakdowns. Yeah. Yeah. We, look, we, we, we're human beings. We employ human beings. Every single one of us gets out of bed every day to go to work and do a great job. But stuff happens. We always like to joke, if, if our employees, if nothing bad happened, we wouldn't have jobs. Yeah. You know, our job is to solve the problems when they happen. Yeah. Awesome. Excellent. Well, the last thing I want to talk about is, again, we talked a little bit about Sunset in the community. And what we're talking about when we talk about Sunset in the community is what we are able to do because each and every one of you has chosen to be part of our family. If you live in the Sumner area, I know you've driven by Sunset Stadium down at the Sumner High School. We have a lot of partnerships we take on with the high school. We also partner every year for the Relay for Life. Um, where we're able to match donations for everybody out walking the track. 
Uh, we do the Sumner down Main Street, which is where uh, they have the car show every year. We're able to collect donations and match donations and give money back to the local economy. And then also the MultiCare, uh, come walk with me. Again, similar to the Relay for Life. Um, you know, one of my favorites, the Ford Drive for your school. Which is great. You go to a football yeah. game in the fall up mm -hmm. at Sumner High School. Mm -hmm. There'll be uh, Fords out there. You can go for a free test drive. Nice. And then Ford donates money to the school. We raise, yeah. we raise a lot of money for the high school doing that. So yeah. that's a great one. Absolutely. And we also have, Sunset has some incredible scholarships that we give every year to uh, the local local school district. So, yeah. And I love being part of the selection process on the on the, yep. on the the young people who who earn those scholarships yeah. so that's that's fun absolutely i would say if you know if there's an event happening anywhere in the sumner bonnie lake uh you know auburn puyallup area mm -hmm. that it's if that event's happening uh, that sunset's involved and it's because of our customers because of you that, that the support we have we're able to give back to our community and it's yep. it's really important to all of us absolutely it is it makes it feel great yeah. Awesome. All right. So now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Again, like we talked about at the beginning, we do have a giveaway. Uh, it's a free complimentary service we're going to offer each and every single one of you guys. And here's some more specifics about it. So what we'd like to give you is something called a Sunset Safe. This is a, a antimicrobial spray treatment to the interior of your car. It kills all the germs and um, organisms that might be there on the plastic and seats and things. And it's a treatment that, that is in... Uh, instant, but it also lasts up to 30 days. It's a $60 value. So all you need to do is send your information to we care at sunsetautofamily.com and send us your name and your uh, vehicle information, and we will turn around and send you a, a gift certificate for that uh, $60 value. You can use it next time you come in for service. Just give us an extra half an hour, and we will apply that treatment to the inside of your vehicle to help try to keep everything clean and safe. Awesome. That's great. All right, guys. Well, we really appreciate you taking the time again with us tonight. We're going to stay behind after the video is over and answer as many questions as we can. And I look forward to seeing you guys all on the drive. Have yep. a good night. Thank you.